Okay, so now I have put the uh, cuttings in there, whatever you want to call them, like stir sticks, uh, to fill in the cracks. So you can see uh, it looks kind of very messed up now, but you can see I've filled in all of the grooves that I cut with these wafers of wood, the one in the ear and the one down the side. You can see the ooze of the glue coming out now, just wipe that off. Um, but I've, I've filled them all in. I'm gonna let that dry overnight. And then I'll finish off tomorrow, I'll finish off the outside. And uh, after that, I'll, I'll do the furring. So what I did in the meantime too is I cleaned the snout up a bit, as you can see, right there. Cleaned it up. So now it's starting to look here more like this. Like the thickness here and the width, it's starting to look like that. Now, to let you know how I cleaned that up, I used a disc that's a rasp disc like this. $15 on Amazon. You can even get them cheaper, maybe 10 bucks. And I use a Dewalt cordless grinder. I put it on there and I just kind of sweep it out. This disc is a flap disc. I was using them all the time, but I don't use them much at all anymore because they can be expensive. So I just use the uh, rasp disc. You could probably make 200 bears with that one disc. Saves a ton of money in flap discs because they could be five bucks each versus uh, versus 11 bucks to do 200 bears or 1500 with that. So anyways, <clears throat> I did clean it off a bit because the rasp disc gets a little bit, uh, you know, coarse. So I did this with a little air grinder, but if you don't have access, you know, just cleaned it off like this. If you don't have access to a, a compressor, no worries. This little attachment you can put on the end of your angle grinder and do the exact same thing. So my next step is I find center. I do this on every single one. There's center of the snout, which is gonna represent this line right here. Then the nose, I just eyeball it, just like that. Then I come around like this, I meet the two sides like that. And then I bring them down right here. I'm getting the light better for you. And after that, I'll draw the mouth where I want it to be. Bring it around here. Same on the other side. After I've, you know, it's all, all uneven, but I'll clean that up. After I do that, you'll see tomorrow, I'll detail this whole snout out. And I'll do it really fast. I might even do it uh, as a video rather than stopping like I'm doing now. I'll do it as a video and uh, show everybody how I do it. And then I, how I do the nose. And it goes pretty fast. So I'll do that tomorrow. But there you go. That's what I've accomplished this evening. I didn't get that much time to work on it this evening, doing a few other things. So I usually carve two or three bears at a time at the same time. This one's taking a bit longer because I keep stopping and starting with the videos and then I have to go and upload the video. So there you go. I hope you like it. Please remember to like and follow and like and subscribe. Thank you so much.